Hello to YouTube and this is a new video of my M24 and uh, yeah for all the viewers who are watching this um, a happy new year um, sorry for the long waiting time but um, I um, it was holidays and uh, I decided to not work in the holidays at least the last weekend uh, I did something yeah <coughs> so um what i actually did um, this weekend was um yeah the uh, trigger group is still the same not gonna talk about it because um, that was in my last video um what i've done is um i make them bold face well a part of it because i still need to make the extractor and uh, the ejector is already done, it's a plunger ejector um, with a lighter spring in it works pretty nice with um, yeah, 0 0.9 millimeter um, metal bar in it but the um, extractor, I may be gonna make, remake the extractor and the plunger because um, if you can see it pops out because it's not um, very good so I might remake that what I also did is um, I made the rest of the bolts yeah um, what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna make the whole bolt out of paper so if you can maybe see so will be this and here another piece of paper here the same 5 centimeter paper to attach this one and uh, make it to the right thickness of the real bolt because I have some blueprints if I can show you that on my computer of the bolt on of the bolt carrier <coughs> so I will show you that in a sec So, um, yeah, it will use the 7.62 by 50 millimeter bullets, just like the real one. Um, yeah, and what I also figured out is um, how to make a threading, because if you can see, like, you can see uh, two parts that I can screw that off. If you can see that, this is just made with the same uh, metal wire, just this type of wire, 50 meters, 0 0.9 millimeter metal wire. And um, I recommend not using it for springs, because it's too weak. So um, yeah, you can make this is only a test and you can make your own uh, threading for like a silencer or your barrel or the <coughs> firing pin so you can uh, de uh, um, disassemble the firing pin from the bolt so you can screw that and it's uh, yeah you need really really lot of lots of force to actually move this because you actually you can't move this actually and yeah it's pretty nice for so um, this might buy, be an idea for other gun builders and so how I made this is um, I just got um, yeah the thing you want to make the threading on is um, you Take a piece of wire and um, yeah, um, yeah. Take a wire and um, put it around and tighten it so it is close to each other. And then take another piece of wire and yeah, put it around all these um, little yeah ink cuts. If you can see. 
So you have a bigger one and you have the smaller one and you can decide um, which one to use. So yeah, um, about, the sh about the blueprints of the bolt. Yep, this is it. Every di dimension is in millimeters, so I'm gonna zoom in a bit. So, this is a side. All this, and this is gonna, this is what I'm gonna use. So, like the bolt is 18 millimeters. Um, wide only the bolt <coughs> well, yeah which you have here yes so this is it and if you want to find this um, you might want to go to um, gradcat.com and I will put a link in the description for you so you can check this out um, it has all sorts of uh, things um, like here you can see the Barrett M07.50 caliber sniper rifle um, or other things but I will put this link in the description so you can check it out and um, there are some dimensions uh, for things like I found the Remington 700 and it's uh, basically for solid works so if you have solid works um, you might um, <coughs> up, um, put, um, open some files and um, were look at it in 3D so yeah, that was it for today and um, yeah, see you next time, I hope.